this shit look crazy. This looks way more than a remaster. It's finally happening though. And it's coming out in 2019 and on the Switch. Let's go. That's crazy on how updated that game looks. That shit looks crazy. Oh, here we go. The main event, baby. Yes. First two dynamics presents. In collaboration. Damn, they scream for anything. Avengers Day. Okay. All right. It looks crazy different, like their own interpretation. But okay. Thor, Tony, check it out. One. Yes. Try to keep up. All right, come on. Show us some gameplay. Whoa, what the fuck? The whole bridge is coming down. Yes! Drop in! There we go. Ooh, is that gameplay? Oh my god. Oh, third person. Yes, third person. And we play as the Avengers? Did Thor make a joke? Cap, they got pulsar tank. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Whoa, was that um I forgot his name. It's slipping me. So it looks like we're going to be able to play at least Tony, Iron Man, Thor, oh look, yeah, we're definitely playing with it, oh, um, Captain, we're playing with everybody, okay. What the fuck? What the fuck happened? The, the the shit fell? Jesus Christ. Others call them murderers. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Is that this guy? We all lost something that day. They killed Cat in the trailer? But that's not how this story ends. Well, who's that? Oh, okay, we got Abomination. Okay. Okay. You could just kill Cap in the trailer. Please show more. What are we waiting for? Whoa, who's that? Okay. No affinity stones are shown. Nothing Please with space. Sean well, they were in space, Creative but... Creative Director, Crystal Dynamics, and Bill Roseman, Vice President and Creative Director, Marvel Games. Okay. Got Crystal Dynamics and Marvel Games on the stage. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Look at his shirt. We love you. Yeah. Thank you, thank you everyone. We are incredibly excited to reveal Marvel's Avengers to the world. Yes, let's go. A few years ago, Crystal Dynamics and Marvel began collaborating on an original Avengers game. One that combined epic action adventure with cinematic storytelling. A game where we as players can experience in both single player and co-op. Yes what it's like to be Earth's mightiest heroes. <laughs> Do I have any true believers in the house? Yes. Yes! Awesome. Because you will instantly recognize your favorite superheroes and villains, but you'll also see that they're unique to this game, as this is Crystal's interpretation 
of these iconic characters. Okay, cool. Our story begins at A Day, as San Francisco celebrates the opening of the Avengers West Coast headquarters. And the team's custom helicarrier, outfitted with a strange experimental energy source. However, the day turns deadly when an attempt to steal this new technology results in massive destruction. Blamed for the tragedy, the Avengers are outlawed and our heroes disband. Okay. Five years later, a horrific Five years evil later? threatens the world. Okay. And our only hope is to reassemble Earth's mightiest heroes. You'll play as your favorite Avengers. Okay. All We're playing as them. Original story showcasing authentic original Marvel stories heroism and humanity. It's about losing what matters to you most and fighting to get it back. Okay. We're losing Cap. Yeah. He's not gonna be a playable character. He's gonna be available for one mission. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Most importantly, this is a story about self-acceptance in the face of adversity, about embracing our individual powers and learning that together we are mighty. <laughs> Yo, the people in the crowd are way too excited. You'll lead the team as a legendary super soldier, Captain America. Okay. You'll call down the lightning as the Asgardian god of thunder, Thor. Okay, we know this. Hulk. You'll channel the anger of scientist Bruce Banner uh, by unleashing the Hulk. Yeah, this guy's excited too. You'll gather intel and strike swiftly Black Widow. ultimate tactical spy, Black Widow. And then Iron Man, of course. And finally, you'll blast through the sky as the charismatic Tony Stark. No to the wider world as the Armored Iron Man. To bring this incredible story to life, we've assembled an all-star cast. I'll let them introduce themselves. Okay. Oh, okay. So, here we are. You got Tom? You got Troy? Who are you people again? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Troy Baker, and I play Bruce Banner. You play everybody. Hi, I'm Jay Sharon, <laughs> That's cool. and I play Captain America. Never heard of I'm you. I'm Travis Willingham, and I play Thor. Never heard of you. Hi, I'm That's Lily. this girl. I'm playing Black Widow. Hi, I'm Nolan North, and I play Tony Stark. Okay. Stone. There's certain characters I don't think you ever have to be uh, talked into. <laughs> yeah. No. You know, so we'd like to have you play Tony Stark Iron Man. Yeah, yes. Uh, <laughs> You know, everybody always portrays him as this super confident character. I think it's a mask for, for him. I think he's a, one of the most vulnerable guys. I think Bruce is just such a cool character. A lot of people are, are really quick to... That's crazy. He's agree. playing Bruce. But I think that... I would have thought they would have paired um, Iron Man and Captain America together. Fun. And I've never played him before. What is very relatable about Natasha is she's extremely capable, but she's at the core. She's human she's surrounded what? by all of this larger than life stuff and she has to step up to it I, I feel like Thor got really interesting in the last like 10 or 15 years from for me yeah I like where he's kind of landed in the, the public eye you know one of the things I think is cool about Cap is I never feel like he uh, he necessarily wants to be a leader he accepts that he is I feel like sometimes the best leaders are the ones who don't necessarily want to be mm -hmm. but they're right for the job. Having an original story to tell as well, uh, what they've done at Crystal Dynamics is great. So That's so cool. Be pretty, pretty this is so cool. The Avengers are at their best when they are all together. But the chemistry is, <laughs> do not shake. <laughs> Thanks everybody for joining us. Can't wait for you to be able to play the game. But right now, you don't have to wait for some exclusive content. Exclusive content, let's go. Five years after A Day. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Did you even check the science? Did it you check? It was a science? heist, Bruce. No. We were outsmarted. No. The Terrigen reactor was unstable, <laughs> and you knew that. You knew that, and you still paraded it before the entire world. So what? We just give up? We didn't. 
give up, Tony. We failed. At least I can Jesus admit that. Jesus Christ, yep. No, we failed him. We failed him. Jesus Christ, this is dark. Please welcome Scott Amos, head of studio, and Megan Marie, senior community and social media manager, Crystal Dynamics. Social media manager and head of studio. So now I can play the game on stage. <laughs> social media. Hello, E3. And my real uh, um, announcer, Lisa. Head of studio. You've just, <laughs> you've just seen a high level view of the cinematic and character-driven campaign of Marvel's Avengers. But launch is only the beginning of this adventure. Launch is only the beginning. Marvel's DLC. Avengers delivers a narrative over multiple years with exciting new content released at a regular basis. Yep. Like the Avengers, you and your friends this are game is stronger be together. $800 You'll by assemble the end of into it. teams of up to four players online. Oh, okay. Online, okay. Online four players. Where you can team. master extraordinary abilities, where you can customize a growing roster of heroes and defend the earth from ever escalating threats. Okay. Oh, yes. That sounds cool. Oh, yes. And to make sure everyone comes on this journey with us, we're incredibly thrilled to announce that every new superhero and every new region will be delivered at no additional cost. Really? So our promise to the community is that we won't have random loot boxes or pay-to-win scenarios. Okay. Yeah. This game represents a collaboration across Crystal Dynamics. Okay. So how are they going to make money continually? I know you're out here. Like, after the game's released, people got the game. These guys are here. You're still making DLC for it. How are they going to get, you know? Our new Crystal Northwest studio. Maybe skins. And They're going to go the Fortnite model or season passes where you have challenges to do, like you have to replay so missions and do different stuff. Maybe? Your powers and living your superhero dreams. We have an exclusive gameplay demo in our booth that will show you more of the core in the campaign, no. its original story, and our superheroes in action. Come on, in the booth? So, Marvel's Avengers will release worldwide on PS4. Xbox One, okay. Stadia, uh -huh. and PC. Right. No Switch, but okay. I wasn't expecting that. We got you covered. <laughs> and we're excited to be partnering with PlayStation to bring some awesome surprises to the PlayStation audience. Okay. Awesome surprises. Including Spider-Man. Early beta access. Early beta access on PlayStation, okay. And unique benefits that we'll be revealing in the future. Oh, a little Spider-Man crossover, maybe? But before we go, we have one final glimpse into our world, including when you'll get to play this game. Okay. This is what's next for the Avengers. Thank you, true believers. Okay. Thank you, true believers. Damn it. What the fuck is that? Hank. I have a plan, but it's risky. Hank. Hank, that doesn't look Ant Man? Come on, Tony, live a little. Unbelievable. It worked. <laughs> it's sort of cute when they're small. Oh, okay. I didn't touch you for a second, Hank. Okay, cool. May 15th, 2020. Okay. And that's it. All right. That was pretty cool. Not one more last surprise. That was fucking... From what we've seen so far is cool. I just... I'm, I'm guessing we're going to see more. Probably tomorrow when E3 starts officially. 
But Jesus Christ, that was cool. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.